we will receive a good reminder why no president, no president was ever better served by his foreign policy team than the 41st president of the United States. There are not enough superlatives for me to describe my gratitude and pride in each of the member of what we call the Gang of Eight. And after Harry Truman became president, Texas owned Sam Rayburn, the Speaker of the House, went to the White House to see the new Commander-in-Chief. And as they were sitting in the Oval Office, Speaker Rayburn offered some free advice. And he said, Mr. President, you're going to have a staff around telling you day in and day out that you're the smartest man in the world. And that's going to have a real effect on you. Uh, but the truth is, Mr. President, we both know it's a damn lie. And <laughs> the truth is, none of the men from whom you're about to hear ever suggested I was the smartest man in the world. But that wasn't their job. Their job was to give me their best advice so that we, working together, could keep America safe while also advancing the values of human freedom and free markets around a world awakening from the Cold War.